All right, just in time for the 4th of July, Challenger paid a visit to us here at WATE. The famous bald eagle lives at the American Eagle Foundation in Sevier County, the first bald eagle in history trained to free fly into stadiums. Well, now Challenger is about to make history again. Here's a preview in tonight's Positively Tennessee. For 25 years, this majestic bald eagle soared high above the 50-yard line. Challenger retired from free flighted appearances in 2019, the year he turned 30. But he still works those beautiful wings at home with the American Eagle Foundation. And he continues to represent our nation at events around the country. Challenger made a visit to our WATE studios this week. Right now you can see he's really fluffy, so he's super content and happy right now. Maybe he can sense that he's about to make history again, about to fly to Branson, Missouri, to receive a high honor, Lee Greenwood's Patriot Award. Challenger's been the ambassador for his species for over 30 years. And to see him honored in this way is so humbling. And it, the team could not be more grateful. It's an award previously only presented to people. Well deserved for this graceful bird, a living symbol of freedom who has inspired millions. Oh, it's going to be a big night for Challenger. Now listen to this. Challenger is also being immortalized at the new Helping a Hero Customized Home for a Veteran in Missouri built in Challenger's honor. A bronze statue of Challenger will be placed outside the home. Johnny Morris, who's founder and CEO of Bass Pro Shops, Lee Greenwood, and baseball legend Roger Clemens will lead the presentations. We are going to get video of it. We'll show you everything just as soon as it comes in.